Well, I've been talking about it for the last couple of weeks or so and we even spoke about it yesterday. But Love Island has now been officially cancelled. It has now been officially cancelled. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. If you haven't already, click that button for daily and consistent. I'm coming at you actually, guys, if you actually deep it, yeah. I'm coming at you not only with daily and consistent content, but I'm coming at you with multiple videos a day. And I've already released one today this morning. This is coming out now and I've got quite a few coming out today. So it's just constantly injecting this content into your veins. That's what it's all about. So subscribe to the channel. It's just one button. Click that button and don't be a pagan and head over to my Instagram and let's get into this video. Love Island, Love Island 2020 summer. You will just be, you will not live to exist. Miss Rona said, listen, you will not be existing. Miss Rona said, please. It's a pandemic. Miss Rona said, relax. Miss Rona said, the bag has been now completely fumbled. Bosses had a look at a number of ways they could try and continue with the filming, including testing the contestants for, for the virus and moving the dates later to the end. How <coughs> However, when Crisis Talks we ha were held over Thursday and Friday, not Crisis Talks chart, it was decided the upcoming series of Love Island was simply not going to be viable. Kevin Ligo, director of the, te of the television, has said, We have tried every way to make Love Island this summer, but logically it's just not possible to produce it in a way that safeguards the well-being of everyone involved and that for us is the priority. In normal, in normal circumstance we will be preparing very soon to travel out to the location in Mallorca to get the villa ready but clearly that's now not as out of the question. We are very sorry for fans of the show but making it safely is our prime concern and Love Island will be back stronger than ever 2021. In the meantime Love Island fans can still enjoy all six series of Love Island on Britbox. A TV insider revealed that all the work that had gone into the upcoming summer series would be d deferred to the winter version which will air next year. They explained a huge amount of work had already gone into the series in terms of laying out plans for the show. Casting had also started with interviews on Zoom for new applicants planning to begin this week. Rising stars on social media had also been tapped up by producers who were already picking out their favourites. Everything will be deferred to the winter version and everyone who was being lined up to appear in the series will be asked to see if they can appear in that series. It's a devastating blow to the entire team working on the show as well as the ITV as a whole but the safety of their contestants and anyone working on Love Island is paramount. Now this idea of priority of contestants, they're bringing it from a perspective where they're like, you know what, they're trying to bring this higher moral ground. If there was a way for them to do it, they would still do it. The idea of priority of, you know, your contestants isn't just for a moral high ground. If they don't bring priority and if one of them gets the virus, they're literally liable to pay so much money. And insurance companies have already confirmed that they're not going to support them. They're not backing it. So the insurance companies are not backing it. They cannot risk losing any money at all because they would lose far more money than any money they would make from the show. It would no longer be an investment. It would be a loss. And because of these insurance companies and the fact that they're not really around to back it as well. Unfortunately, Love Island w w Summit is not taking place, child. And Love Islanders themselves are reacting. And this is what they're saying. Um, Dr. Alex George said, this is a shame, but ultimately the right and safe decision for all involved. Jack Fowler said, now nah, my head is gone. Okay, then Marvin Brooks said, heartbreak. Um, Big said, this is a madness. Um, Frank, uh, we just have a bear of these islanders that everybody has forgotten. So, um, yeah, they really can't be talking about anybody else. Like, you guys will even remember them now. This is why it's a madness. Let me know your thoughts are when it comes to this video. Love Island has now been cancelled. It is what it is, child. Miss Rona said, the bag is going to be just, it's just going to be crippled, fumbled, gone. And you know, there's humor in it, but also I feel sorry for the people who actually work for the show, the production team and everyone, and the amount of money they would, you know, be at loss at. They've also got children to pay, children to pay. They've also got children as well. And you know, just you have your, your other partner, you, you want to support yourself, you're now out of a job. So it's difficult as well. So although we make our jokes, it really isn't that much to laugh about. It's actually also a very sad time. So let me know your thoughts are when it comes to this. Are you guys happy that the season is canceled? I feel like we were just getting way too much of the show. Which would then mean that when the winter version comes, it's going to bang because we haven't seen Love Island for a while. Which makes it even more bad for these winter lot that just left because it's like your season's going to bang but the next winter one will because there's no summer one. Plot twist. Subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.